Hello, how are you? It's me, Patch. Today, we're gonna play some more number block math link cubes. I really enjoyed it last time and I know lots of you have been watching it at home. So I thought, rather than doing another experiment today, I'm actually, because it's a bit cold and wet outside, I'm actually gonna do another bit of playing with number blocks. And I hope you can enjoy it. We'll do some more soon if you like it, but for now we're going to do a bit of math links and we're going to do some maths and some adding and some shapes and some patterns and also learn about the squares and the different amounts of cubes in them. Hopefully you already know some of these, but if not, it's okay. We're going to have lots of fun together. Are you ready? Yeah! Let's go! Woo! Alright guys, so we've got our number blocks all here. You can see them all, can't you? Yes, do you recognise them? That's right, we've got number one, number two, number three, and number four, number five, number six in the mix, lucky number seven, number eight, octoblock, number nine, and I'm ten. That's right, okay, number blocks, are you ready for a challenge? Oh, I'm ready for one, so am I. That was lucky that you asked that. Okay, good. Well, in that case, we're gonna get these cards. Do you remember these things from last time? That's right. We've got different ones now. So what we're gonna do is do something called a pattern first on this card. And on this card, there's a pattern here. Right, so what I'm gonna do is bring the camera in a little bit closer and we're gonna zoom in on this pattern. So first of all, can you tell me what you see? I see one, two, three, four red squares, which looks like number one, doesn't it? So what do you think we need to continue it? There's no different squares there, is there? No. So I think if we put a number one, a number one, and another number one, that's our little pattern completed. Brilliant, that's great. Okay, let's try the next one. Look, orange, red, orange, red. So that looks a little bit like number two's face at the beginning. Here's two's face, and then one's face, and then two's face, and then one's face. That's what that looks like, doesn't it? So if we continue the pattern, orange, red, orange, red. Do you think we need orange, red, orange? Yeah, we do, don't we? So we do this, and that's the pattern. So we've got orange, red, orange, red, orange, red, orange. Brilliant, wow, so clever guys, well done. Now it gets a little bit more tricky now, because now we're gonna have three colors. So this time we've got red, orange, yellow, and we've got red, and then something, something, something. So what comes after red on that pattern? Red, orange, that's right. So we put orange after this red one, and then we've got red, orange, yellow. So if we do red, orange, and then yellow, that's right. And then we're back to the beginning where red is again. Brilliant. So we've got red, orange, yellow, red, orange, yellow, red. Fantastic, well done guys, that's brilliant. Okay, next up, again a little bit more complicated, we've got blue, red, red. Blue, what do you think? That's right, if we do blue, red, red, blue, red, red. And then just at the end for a bit of fun, we've got another blue. Yeah, so blue, red, red, blue, red, red, blue. Excellent, well done guys, that was really, really well done. Fantastic stuff. That means we can move on to the next one now because we were so good at completing that card. I think the next one should be more of a shape pattern one. Yeah, amazing. Okay, so this time we've got some fun shapes we can do this with and it's all to do with one, two, three, four and five and what they make in here. Do you know where number one might go? Do you think it's there? No, not there. What about here? How many blocks are there? One, two, three. Well, that's not number one, is it? What about this one? Is that only one? 
It is, that's right. So look, number one fits there. That's right. So next up, what we'll do, we're gonna lay her down like this because that way we're gonna see more patterns. So where does number two fit? Can you see where there's only two? What about this one? One, two, three, four, five. Ah, oh, no, it's not that one, is it? What about this one? One, two. Yeah, that's the one. Okay, here's number two. Number two. And he fits just there. Brilliant, fantastic. Okay, what about three? I think I can see three straight away. Can you see it? One, two, three. That's a fun pattern. There she goes, she fits right there. Yay, I'm three. You are three, that's right. What about four? Hmm. Oh look, there he is, that looks just like him. One, two, three, four. That looks just like number four's shape. Come on four, in you go. I'm four. That's right, brilliant. And then this one here, what do you think this is? One, two, three, four, five. That's right, have we got a five that looks like that? We do, I made this one up earlier. There we go. Oh, but wait, there's one more left. But I thought it was only for one, two, three, four, and five. Well, what's happened there? That must be another one again. How many squares are here? One, two, three, four. <gasps> Whoa, that's brilliant. Look at that. We've done great shapes there, haven't we? Look at all those fun shapes. That means that they don't all have to just stand up, do they? Number four makes a square, which is when you've got the sides the same as your height and length. So two blocks and two blocks, that makes a square. Amazing. Right. <clears throat> And number one is a tiny square because she's one block and one block, just one block. Okay, so next up, let's get these guys. Thanks guys, you're welcome. Give me a high five. Oh, okay, Psh, yes, excellent. Right, here we go. Let's see what's next. Are you ready? Yeah, I am. Now next, we're gonna do some adding. Dun, dun, dun. Oh, look. What do you think these are here? So this is number five in the middle, and this is all about five's friends, and it's gonna be all to do with five, which is one, two, three, four, five, there on the fingers, and then six, seven, eight, nine, and 10 are on the other hand, up the back here. So what we have to do is we start with five, and we have to add numbers on to see what we get. So the first one is five, add one, which is this one here, five plus one, and that, thing there which is two lines means equals which means what that comes to so if we add number five here and number one what comes after five one two three four five six oh, that's right so the first answer is number six in the mix that's right brilliant number six this next one here is five plus two so if we've got one two three four five and we add number two, here we are. It makes one, two, three, four, five, six, <gasps> seven! Oh, my friend number seven. Oh, I'm lucky. Hello, nice to see you again. Okay, number seven, over here then. Thank you. Okay. Right, he's very polite, isn't he, seven? That's funny. Okay, next up is five plus three. And what do we think that makes? So we've got number five here and we add number three, it makes one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Oh, look, here we go. Octoblock, oh, Octa fall over. <laughs> okay, Octoblock, over here then, that's right. Next up, five plus four equals, what do we think that makes? Shall we check? Where's number four? Here you are, number four. I'm four. Okay, brilliant. Oh, it's got a bit peevy there. So, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Whoa. So the answer is number nine. Yay. Brilliant. Come on then, number nine. Okay, before you sneeze, silly. And next up, the final one is five plus another five. 
What? So we've got number five there. High five. Ah. And we're going to add another five. She's a lot bigger than that one, isn't she? Five, add five. What do we think that makes down here? Equals one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, <gasps> ten. <clears throat> I'm ten, ten, ten again. How are you guys? We're good, thanks. Excellent. Off we go. Okay, brilliant. Well done adding, guys. That's fantastic maths. Okay, we've got time for one more now. So now we're going to do one which is all about squares, just like we mentioned a minute ago. Just a very quick one to finish our little video on. And don't worry, I'll do some more soon as well, just for fun. So these two are the squares that are bigger than one in our set from one to 10 that we have here. And what they are is number four, it tells you here with the colors, one and two. So we've got one, two blocks sideways and one, two blocks top ways. So two blocks up, two blocks across, and that makes a square of four blocks because it's the same height as it is across. And that's what makes number four if we sit in there. And then nine is the next biggest one because instead of one, two, and one, two, it's one, two, three, and one, two, three. Wow, so that means number nine. That's great. Now, do you remember which one the smallest square is that's not on here? If we've got one, two, three, and one, two, three, and then this one's one, two, and one, two, we've got one and one. That's right, number one, brilliant. I wonder if we can do more squares another time. Yeah, that'd be great. Okay, so let's get these guys over here. And we're going to whoop, just jog the camera, apparently. Here we are. So actually, do you know what? We're going to do one more really quick one. And this is Blockzilla. I'm Blockzilla. I want a friend. So this means more than, and this means less than. It's a little bit tricky, but we're gonna have a bit of fun with it anyway. So what this means is if number three is on this side of Bloxilla's mouth, behind Bloxilla, it has to be a smaller number than number three. Now, do you know what smaller numbers there are than number three? You do? Brilliant. I think it might be number five? No? Okay, it's not five, you're right. So three, smaller than three, is two, or number one. They're both smaller than three, so they'd be correct answers. And on this one here, this means that number four is smaller than whatever's on this side. You can see the mouth is getting bigger, so it means the smaller end is the smaller number, and the bigger end of the mouth is where the bigger number must be. So we can put any numbers that are bigger than four on that side. So we can't have one or two or three, and number four is already there. So if we put five there, that will work. Yay, I'm bigger than four. Exactly. Or six in the mix. I'm bigger than four too. That's right. Or number seven. That was lucky that I'm bigger than number four. That's right. Or Octoblock. Octoblock's bigger than four. It's two or fours. That's right, Octoblock, you are. Or even Number nine, I'm a square that's bigger than four, like we saw a minute ago. That's correct, yeah. And finally, the biggest one in our set of one to 10 is, that's right, 10 again. I'm bigger than four. I'm six bigger than four. You are, that's right. Brilliant. Well, that was great, guys. I had such a nice time. Did you? Yeah, brilliant, that's great. Which one should we say goodbye to today? I think we deserve a high five from number five. Can I have a high five? Ready? Yeah, brilliant. High five, Woo. to the side, up above, down low, too slow. That's right, brilliant. And also, I'd like to say, please come again soon, because number two will miss you. Okay, fantastic. Whoa, <laughs> I had so much fun doing that. Did you? 
Excellent, I really enjoy playing with the number blocks. Hopefully, you can join me again soon. We'll do some more playing, it'll be really good, and we learn some more numbers and some more things to do with maths and adding them all up. And I'm also gonna do a little video soon about actually just adding numbers and how you know how to add from one and two and three and four and all sorts of things like that. So hopefully we'll see you soon. In the meantime, please do subscribe, that'd be amazing. Hopefully you like this and always be kind and be you. Take care, see you soon, bye. Ah!